Champagne for me is so special. I mean, when you start playing around with words like terroir, it's the one thing that defines. And I must admit, I think Australian sparkling wine has come on so much in the last 25 years, but it is still not champagne. It doesn't have that wonderful sense of individuality, that terroir, and it's such a celebratory drink. There is so much to learn about, um, you know, how it's created, the um, champagne styles, the different houses and all the new wave um, champagne producers, which is really exciting. Champagne is an amazing wine. I love champagne. It's a great uh, opportunity to learn some more about champagne. It's such a diverse wine, uh, and this is a wonderful opportunity to taste a wide variety of it. There are a number of affordable champagnes out there, part of that driven by competition, part of that driven by a strong Australian dollar. And with our very wide reaching retailers, um, it is very accessible for people. Nonetheless, um, at the top end we've got these um, specialty houses, um, we've got our prestige wines that add flavour and interest and character. And I guess for me, uh, consumers always want to talk about champagne. Yeah, absolutely. Champagne's a wonderful accompaniment to food. Given the diverse array of, of um, champagne, we often think about it as an aperitif, but um, we've had a number of dinners uh, where we've had champagne right throughout the meal, and it's a wonderful opportunity to show just how diverse this is. Champagne's a region, and this is a wine of a region, and just as with any region, this wine lasts right throughout a meal. I have heard of the Honda Champagne Awards. I was very fortunate um, two years ago to in the finals, uh, which was very exciting, and uh, I've spent quite a bit of time uh, in preparation for this year's awards, and I'm uh, looking forward to that very much. 1990 was the year, and I've been a finalist the year before, but in 1990 it was successful, and what a trip. I mean, two weeks of absolute red carpet champagne. Um, it was an absolute joy. And for me, the great thing was, yes, I knew some of the well-known houses, the Grindmark houses, the names where it would be more familiar in Australia, uh, but being able to spend time with growers in the vineyards, in their cellars, um, it was just a great fun trip.